So this paper will investigate the extent to which these school accountability measures influence the housing market, and more specifically, whether or not these school accountability measures are capitalized into housing prices. The motivation for this study stems back to Taibo's 1956 seminal paper on residential sorting. Of course, in that model, we have local bundles of public goods which vary across communities, and they're priced at different prices which are reflected in the local tax rates. So the idea there is this variation is going to induce migration, and this will be the key force behind residential sorting. Communities and the competition between communities then will enforce the local governments to provide the efficient level of public goods and services in equilibrium. So this model has long since been the basis for the reasons why economists argue that the housing market represents an informative form of school choice. But the key component of this model is that consumers must have adequate knowledge of the quality of goods and services that they're consuming. So we can imagine if these school accountability measures provide a signal of school quality, they will also have implications on residential sorting and decisions. There are other advocates of increased school choice, and they advocate policies in which a household has a choice over many different schools through the use of either vouchers or charter schools within the community. And the idea there being we can provide bonuses to these local schools in the form of um, incentives for those that receive high demand for enrollment. And this competition between these schools will again provide the necessary checks and balances which lead to the efficient and effective level of educational services within our community. But Hansek 1981 points out that these school choice programs are good in theory, but the success depends crucially on how parents make these choices and what information they use to inform these choices. So again, we can see that school accountability measures to the extent that they send a signal about school quality can have an impact on not only on residential sorting, but the success of these school choice programs. 